Welcome, friends and foes. I am still getting bombarded with Discord messages, and I am still putting it off. But I have scanned through a couple messages, and I must say, I am a little disheartened by some of the things that I am reading. And what I am disheartened by is how many people are longing. Now, I am willing to accept the probabilities that there is a small, small chance that we could just miraculously break up out of this and go up higher and, and to go into something like this. That's always a possibility, but I find it very unlikely. So, some people are saying, well, this is a reversal wedge. It's, it's, a, it's a reverse re wedge. So, here's where we are at right now. And let's go back in history. Oh, all the way back to seven days ago. We had our first drop. And we formed an eerily similar wedge. With an arch. Came up and look what happened. What happened? We went down. We went sideways. Sideways at this level for 14 all the way to... The 18th, four days. Now let's fast forward. Things are a little more volatile, a little more up and down, but the pattern remains the same. So, forget the RSI. Forget the moon boys. Forget the trading view, perma bulls. The we believe in crypto, and so it's gonna get higher. Right now, you are getting sucked in. You're getting vacuumed into a Chinese octopus. Yes, the dragon is far away. The Chinese dragon came and burned. And there's still some afterburn to go through. But now, we are facing an octopus with many legs or arms so it is my expectation that we float in this sideways channel Ooh, we're coming into Thanksgiving it's our first technically maybe even our second holiday of the winter season and so far we're one for one on well going down I expect us to be two for two going down so crypto face I sent you Bitcoin to join your whale group your signals group you haven't added me yet I wanted I need a position what am I to do well let me tell you what I am doing I am setting in shorts at the 4,500 to maybe one up to 4,700, expecting us to go sideways and then down again. Now, we've been rather accurate for the past good few months. So, it's I can only show you the door. You have to walk through it. Even some of my pupils that I've taken on here recently have messaged me and said that they are longing. So, I cannot do it for you. I cannot 
Am, am I casting pearl before swine? Because I don't think most of you are even bulls. Most of you are pigs. And pigs get slaughtered. I am still in my hibernation. Uh, I will get through my Discord messages, I promise. But I'm still in hibernation. But the least thing I can do is give you an update on the market, what I am doing, and how I am navigating. Remember, we sold our last short at 4050 I'm confident that I can slice the pig rather than hold my position perhaps the smart thing to do we first started shorting all the way up back at 6200 6000 that's when we first had our shorts in and yes I could have held that short and not exited but I'm confident that I can catch a couple bottoms and catch shorts on ca catch shorting the tops shorting the bounce backs because that's all I believe these are these are all just bounce backs to an eventual, uh, eventual sell to the downside. I know that we have a lot of time. I know that patience is key just as much as seizing opportunities. Both the same. So, please do not send me messages about how you are longing because all you're doing is I believe hurting yourself and yes yes I have a short even all the way down here at 4200 yes I shorted 4200 yes 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 and I'm entering more positions but I have low enough leverage where I believe I'm covered and I have a fiat position waiting to strike if we touch these higher levels I'm certainly more comfortable holding a short than i am alone i guarantee if you check both of our pulses check my pulse against someone that's longing right now and we'll see who's calmer and who's less emotional history repeats itself and it's going to repeat itself but i believe maybe a little a little soon the Indians, are, the, the pilgrims are coming. And and there's going to be some dead Indians and some dead pilgrims and some dead pigs. Some fat bears. 